Today we're going to be looking at the laser pistol of Fallout New Vegas. My name is Stanley 111 and welcome to the Fallout Armory. The AEP-7 laser pistol was put into service to replace the AEP-5 model. With a generous battery size, tight shot gripping range, resilience to extended use, and a fairly decent damage output. It is a very good choice of a sidearm, and it is used extensively by the Brotherhood of Steel and the Enclave of the Capital Wasteland in Fallout 3. The laser pistol returns as an entry-level energy pistol in New Vegas. The laser pistol is one of the weakest energy weapons, but is also the most common. Unlike the majority of the weapons in Fallout New Vegas, the laser pistol does not have a true iron sights function, so it feels very similar to the weapons out of Fallout 3. It requires a strength of 1 and an energy weapon skill of 0. The pistol has a damage ranging from 8 all the way up to 13.5 and it takes energy cells as ammunition. The pistol weighs 3 pounds and is roughly valued at about 175 caps. The laser pistol can fire a total of about 995 times using standard cells, the equivalent of 34 reloads from full condition before breaking. The laser pistol has multiple different unique variants, two of which are from the DLC quests, so we're going to talk about them in a later episode. Pew Pew, one of them, has a higher damage of around 75, and also being unique, it is very, very valuable compared to the normal variant, and it is valued around about 2,500 caps. Pew Pew can fire a total of about 395 times using standard cells, the equivalent of 198 reloads from full condition before breaking. The upper casing of Pew Pew is coloured red and the focus adjustment knob on the rear of the gun has a Sunset Sarsa Perilla bottle cap with a crookedly drawn star attached by a screw. Underneath the bottle cap are the words had it coming, etched into the casing along with eight hash marks. Pew Pew is found in the Sunset Sarsa Perilla HQ during the quest, a valuable lesson. On top of the main body is a wooden plate with what appears to be two capacitators attached by nails. Strapped on by black tape and wired into the main body in CDs by red and blue wire, hinting at its extra power output. Another unique variant is the Missing Laser Pistol. The Missing Laser Pistol is only acquired through the unmarked quest, Pistol Packing. It is exactly the same as the normal pistol, but with a lacking damage. Sadly, it cannot use other variants of energy cells as ammunition. Hope this has helped you out, and make sure to tell me what you want me to do next in the comments. My name is Stanley111, and I hope you have enjoyed yourself. Make sure to drop a comment, drop a like, and subscribe if you've not done so already. See you guys next time.